Hi everyone, so my this particular video is related to the interview document for Hindustan Aeronautics Limited. So this uh, HL interviews are uh, going to come now soon. आपको इंटरव्यू शेड्यूल आ गया है अक्टूबर में आपके इंटरव्यू होंगे नाइन्थ टू इलेवेंथ अक्टूबर टाइम है आपके पास यू कैन मेक गुड प्रिपरेशन एंड एच में देर आर टू काइंड ऑफ सीड्स दिस टाइम वन इज मैनेजमेंट अनदर इज डिज़ाइन इंजीनियर एंड मैनेजमेंट ट्रेनिंग डिज़ाइन ट्रेनिंग डिज़ाइन ट्रेनिंग में मोर फोकस विल बी ऑन टेक्निकल एंड मैनेजमेंट ट्रेनिंग में मोर फोकस विल बी ऑन योर केस स्टडीज एंड टेक्निकल ऑल्सो Knowledge of Hindustan Aeronautical Limited. This document is all about HL, its products and its vision, mission, what they want as organization. When they ask you question, why you want to join HL? Answer should come on the basis of information of HL. So information of HL and what they are into, what is this organization all about, what are various products? That is very important. Sometimes he will ask you that do you know what is Tejas? Do you know what is Dhruv? Do you know what is Kaveri? You, why, why you want to join HL? How do you think aeroplane flies? So they are very basic question. कई बार students बोलते हैं कि HR कम आता है, लेकिन they don't even know that what is HR. So he will ask you all sort of basic questions. उसके लिए this document is very very important for you, and you should know, you should visit the website of HL also. This uh, document will be available on panel of Europedia or website of Europedia. You can take it, and at the same time start your preparation of interview as soon as possible. and you should be very clear whether you are going for design training or uh, you know management training accordingly the mentors are going to ask you the question i'm giving this document to you read this document but i will tell you uh, you know sir sir what is the main crux point of this what you have to read whenever you go for any organization into of any organization you should know what is the vision of that what is the mission of that vision mission is important because this helps you to tell uh, give the answer that why you want to become part of this organization as Uh, vision of this organization is to become leader in aerospace and defense industry that means you should have some idea about what is the various aerospace industries in india and defense industry in india public private sector and all and also you know uh, design manufacturing and other kind of skills which you, you can acquire by joining hl <coughs> hindustan aeronautical limited uh, you can always refer some kind of internet Uh, you know source of information so uh, who's who's the who was the founder of this where is the head office of this those kind of things you should be aware when was it founded and all now <coughs> we are going to provide you some point wise information of this organization like when was it established and uh, what was uh, you know uh, who established it in the beginning and uh, who was the first chairman of the company and uh, where is the headquarter of hl and the date when it was established and what was the first aircraft which was made by hl so this harlo trainer this is the first aircraft which india built in july 1941 before even independence so we have uh, quite uh, you know uh, history long history for that it is the oldest and largest aerospace and defense manufacturer uh, in the world uh, you can say and uh, hl is one of the it is not the most but it is one of the oldest oldest because as you can see 1941 what are the initial products which uh, hl made that name you should be aware and what is currently there in hl how many dedicated research and development centers are there if you are doing your mtech or you are already mtech or you doing phd why you want to become uh, you know Uh, scientist in hl why you want to join it um, as engineer or uh, management trainee so you can always say that my inclination for you know r and d is the reason for that so who is the board of director and uh, you know uh, who appoints the board of directors various kind of directors those names also you should be aware i'll discuss with you and it comes under ministry of defense and you should know who is the minister of defense so it is a designing manufacturing fighter jets helicopter jet engine so these are the products which hl is producing so uh, it is not only designing it is manufacturing also so those things you should be knowing and also you should be knowing about the meaning of this so a uh, marut fighter bomber was the first indigenously fighter aircraft which was made in india by hl so what is marut fighter bomber that uh, some idea you should have who does not know about mig mig we have taken from russia but now we are trying to indigenize the things here hindustan uh, two companies were there earlier hindustan aircraft limited and aeronautics india limited which eventually uh, you know became later on as hal and presently what work we are doing in which domain what are the various verticals of hl that also you should know 
so tejas and dhruv they are the two main products normally in the interview he will ask you are you aware about tejas are you aware about dhruv so dhruv is helicopter tejas is you know light combat aircraft so this is these are the two products of hal also hal is the customer sometimes he ask ask you who are our customers so airbus boeing honeywell these are the customers we make some kind of products for them airbus is european based uh, passenger aircraft carrier you know manufacturer boeing is american based so honeywell american based these are some of the companies uh, to to which hl is supplying some products now make in india you know this government comes out with the make in india product uh, pro this policy and uh, that was the flagship program so we want to increase the share of defense export to achieve the target of 5 billion dollars by 2025 so for that you know we need to uh, create some logistic bases in indonesia malaysia sri lanka and hl is planning for that so sometime we ask you what is the annual turnover of this hl and all now this is very very important because they ask you what are the various products of hl so as i told you marut tejas dhruv rudra then kaveri is the engine which drdo is using saras is the transport aircraft so rustam pushpak these are some of the names of the products and also uh, some of the technologies which uh, is provided by drdo or bharat electronics Uh, uh, or indian ordnance factories so this uh, manufacturing of these products uh, is uh, done by hl indian ordnance factory is also manufacturer of the weapon system and ammunition so these drdo bharat electronics their government and public sectors so this is also doing this and with isro it is creating some gslv engines and all that is done with isro so where are the r and d centers of uh, uh, hl so there are 17 uh, uh, r and d centers are there and uh, 31 types of aircraft so far are produced and they 17 have indigenous design so we are trying to indigenize that means we will make these things in india itself we will have our own technology so various names of r and d centers and what these r and d centers are doing i am not saying that you have to remember all but some center which is close to your place let us say you are from bangalore you should know that if you are from nasik you should know that if you are from kanpur lucknow uh, korwa you should know that so like gas turbine r and d center is in koraput so if you are from that part you should be knowing which is the r and d center sometime they will ask you when you say i am from this part they may ask you that now some of the news uh, related to hl in news uh, in 2020 2021 2022 2023 2023 some important news just if you can go through this uh, what were the news why hl was in news and it is in news because of the products only so just go through this once not very important but just go through once uh, so that you get an idea about that now who is the cmd uh, so anant krishnan is the cmd uh, additional charge of cmd he has taken and he is also a fin chief financial officer and also director finance so he has taken the additional charge of cmd maybe uh, soon cmd will be appointed so he is as of now the cmd and sometime they will ask you who is the director hr so if you go on the website of uh, you know just this document i am recording today that is in uh, uh, september only but sometime new things up, uh, updates are provided on the website so once you go through this document uh, sit with this document and the pen in your hand and go to the website maybe sometime you get some idea from the website also so ab pradhan has taken as a director hr uh, ab Pr pradhan has taken director hr in hl so he is you know sometime he will ask you what is the background of pradhan from which background is he and what is the background and th those things also you should be knowing like uh, uh, pradhan uh, is done his uh, post graduation in uh, management and labor welfare from utkal university bhubaneswar so maybe if you are from bhubaneswar they they will sometime ask you that what is the background of uh, director hr and if you are from odisha you should be knowing this there are other directors also who are from uh, different places you should be aware about that also and what are the various uh, customers international customers boeing airbus i told you and then there are some domestic customers indian air force indian army indian navy they are the domestic customers that also you should be knowing and also as i told you hl is into you know manufacturing also so they have some test facilities so where are the test facilities bangalore lucknow hyderabad that information also you should have <coughs> what are the international customers so as i told you airbus boeing 
uh, and these are some other names GE they are the customers of you know this HL that also you should be knowing uh, go through this media releases which are recent like 2023 like what are the least recent developments related to uh, HL so uh, in Aero India show was conducted in Bangalore in Feb itself so Air Force Station Yela Hanka that was there and Atmanirbar formation flight of some uh, helicopters was conducted there so advanced light helicopter Prachand light combat helicopter light utility helicopter so they were displayed in that particular fair so where is was this conducted that question can be asked Tuma Karu. Tuma Karu is in Karnataka and recently Prime Minister dedicated new helicopter factory to the nation at uh, Tuma Karu, Gubbi in Karnataka. So that is also example of Atam Nirbar Bharat. So this is a uh, recent uh, you know, development and then some more information from 2021. Who is our defense minister and who is the minister of state for uh, defense? That information is important that you should be knowing. The rest I think is the same information which uh, you have read uh, there. So I will advise you to go through this entire information which are the media information so that you get an idea that what kind of uh, updates are there related to HL. Hindustan Aeronautical Limited uh, Management Academy is also there. So sometime they may ask you that okay have you heard about this uh, management academy aviation management uh, related to aviation management aviation management production management those kind of options so uh, where is this academy those kind of things also you should know that is in also Bangalore yes now uh, department of defense production uh, is something which is a very very important department under ministry of defense uh, ministry of defense and uh, defense public sector undertakings these are the names so uh, this Hindustan Aeronautical Limited is not the only one then there is a Bharat Electronics Limited, Bharat Dynamics Limited, these Mazgaon Dog Limited these all come under defense public sector uh, so this is a defense production department of defense production under the Ministry of Defense these all come under that so these are the informations please go through that I think that is more than sufficient the information about HL you don't need more than that just revise this information and go to the interview uh, but some information which is relevant to you you should go through that after you go through this document go to the website and update something which I must have missed or which is more relevant to you do that and I'm very sure you will do very good in the interview and don't miss going for mock and snaps with your PDR. all the very best thank you